I'm actually live now. Um, man, let me tell you technical issues. They are, they are not fun. Alright, but I've got it all sorted now. Internet was, first of all, under maintenance in the morning, so it's like, oh, okay, I can't even do that. And then when it finally did come back up, I don't know, I think I, think I got a dodgy HDMI cable that I need to replace, but it just wasn't doing anything in terms of video signal. But I'm here now. Apologies if you uh, did try to watch this earlier, but just... Internet. That's all I gotta say. Okay, sorry, that was just the capture card reset. Alright, um, I'm gonna continue this, because I need to finish it. Alright, we'll see where we go. I think I was just up to that, right? Yeah. store. Where is it? Oh, already had it. Where have I seen this sort of thing before? I feel like I've seen that specifically somewhere in another platformer. I mean, look, this game is an amalgamation of platformers from this era. I can't put my finger on it, but that specifically I had seen somewhere else. I'm 
progress, because I think there was a sequel to this. If they're gonna remake that as well. trying really hard not to uh, run into God of War spoilers, but I'm kind of glad that I, I didn't pick it up. I was leaning towards picking it up, but I think what changed my mind ultimately is just the price tag. It's a bit hefty. from here till Christmas I'll have a sale. It, doesn't, it really doesn't take long, like... People pick it up day one and then they play through it and a couple months later it's, it's gone on sale. I think for that one specifically, like, just... Spoilers, people want to play it themselves, so. Probably not one of those games that you pick up right away. Unless you, you are a gigantic streamer. Oh no, they laugh. And... <laughs> okay. It's like a, a happy Gilmore and the Clown laugh and then kill them. <laughs> Imagine hearing that. That would make you afraid of clowns, I'm sorry. As a kid. Just a violent yell. Oh. Uh-oh. I I'll stop. Yeah, glitch the game, yeah. Glitch passive every single game without failure. Be the default zoom. I don't know why it starts so zoomed in.
Perception, and you can walk off the balloons. I mean, I already got the bonus <laughs> last time, so it, it's just, it takes too long. And I, I'm like, really, am I going to go through 59 lives? I'm not going to go through 59 lives. I just read Barrel Blast. Is this about to now jump into Donkey Kong territory? I mean, it already has with the letters. Now you see, it's different. Donkey Kong has four letters. Pac-Man has six. This reminds me of, um, there's an interview with Vanilla Ice on sampling. Because, you know, Vanilla Ice sampled the, uh, Under Pressure by Queen. So, it's an interview and, you know, they're asking him about this. And sampling in general. And perhaps gives one of the greatest responses I've ever heard, but... It's almost a verbatim this, so he's like, no, you don't, you see, their song is like, dun 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 dun, and then my song is, dun 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 ch. Like, the t he straight up makes the tune with his mouth, and they sound exactly the same. And he's asserting, no, they're, they're totally different. Unique ideas, you know? I mean, I get what he was trying to say, but just a very, very poor example. <laughs> but you gotta admit, the first 10 seconds of the song, I'm not really sure which song is about to play. Like, yes, there's a difference, but if, you, if it's just coming up and, you know, you have no context and you didn't pick the song, then, of course, going to be difficult to know. But yeah, it's pretty funny. Stupid vanilla ice. I 
think I misunderstood what it meant by Barrel Blast. Oh. See, I was expecting something like Donkey Kong, you know? Also, Speedrun Strat. But I'm guessing the blast is like the poison gas? I don't know. Don't grab. Okay, do it again. I got the feeling I'm gonna need it. Pac-Man, please. He just doesn't ha jump high enough, so all right, let's just.
Okay. Okay. Genuinely surprised I got that first try. Oh, come on. to go off to the side of the balloon. It reminds me of um, Crash Bandicoot, like the insane trilogy and just how Crash would slip off stuff. I really wish I could skip this. This is the rescue one. I don't know what I was expecting there. Like, oh, I was expecting a secret. That's what I was expecting. Not the balloons again. <laughs> oh, I don't like these balloons. Cool. Get a one up for dying in attempting to get the one up. Classic. Thank you. 
Oh, these deaths are embarrassing. Trying to shortcut stuff too much. Yeah, depth perception is the biggest problem. I appreciate the classic. It's well before my time, but I, I have the appreciation for it. Backwards. 
count how many times the double tap gets me killed. Naming on this is really weird, like a circus that has hot plates. <laughs> a, this to me would be more in like a, a chef or a kitchen type setup. I don't understand why a circus has hot plates. <sighs> I hesitated. to assume that was the fruit. <laughs> okay. It's kind of hard to tell. Died. Okay. I got super lucky. Stop doing that. I keep controlling it like as if I'm playing Yoshi, you know how he does this. So I keep double tapping X to do that move, but it's, it's square. I kind of wish it was inverted, but it's fine. It's just 
you know, muscle memory that it's fighting, because I had Yoshi's Island as a kid. And when this is in the game, I, I can't help but not think that's the way it works. Paxis? Okay. Imagine if this has a score that I have to hit to achieve a certain goal. Like, imagine that, and I'm just throwing here. actually gonna race me or is he just gonna like animate a car I don't remember this so this is why I'm asking no, okay he's got clowns this is like first person Mario Kart cheaters Pac-Man racing, who would have thought? Quite a bit of leeway with this. Ages to go. 
Possibly at the end here, yeah, I guess we'll see. Or it's possible that there's one area after this, we'll see. Is it... Is it considered lazy to just take the same theme and just play it under different different tunes, you know, like give it a different feel. Oh no, we 
have gone way too far. I've quite clearly missed something. Oh, come on. No, <laughs> stop it. Hitboxes there. Didn't shit they can. Challenging, genuinely.
so pointless. The stage is, is eating all my lives, and here I was like, ah, oh, there's no way I'm gonna go through 50 plus lives. No, stop it! Stop asking! <laughs> Surprised this is not a maze. I say maze, but it's not really a maze. It's just conceptually eating the ghosts. Attacked by Pokemon. a long stage compared to the others I mean
bounced on it. There we go. These segments, dude. So there's a trick to this one. I don't think this can sort 100% to get anyway. Suddenly the difficulty took a spike. Turn on easy mode. Oh no, it might be because no. It might be because of um me not getting everything. Just in case. Copyright notice is not an option. Stop it. Seem to say it. child to whom this game probably went out to as a purchase before you can play this game child who is probably under the age of consent will you please read this license agreement privacy policy in terms of use and agree to it as it is a legally binding contract that surely applies to you the child who is playing this game I just imagine if, if that had popped up when I was a kid. Like, just... I'm dumbfounded when that happens, you know? Like, on something that actually has sort of a live service vibe to it, sure. But something like this, come on, really? Their defenses. No, but like the child should get the parent to read that. 
before they can play the game. If only gaming boycotts worked, just, you know, they don't. <laughs> Boycotting any company that puts a privacy policy when a game comes up, just to discourage that behaviour. of boycotts, I always think back to the, the first time Modern Warfare 2 came out, and how the servers were going to be peer-to-peer, -peer and then there was like this massive uproar, and they're like, we're going to boycott the game, we want dedicated servers, and then, you know, release day comes out, and practically everyone in that Steam group is playing the game, so it's like, good job, boycott. Need to be more patient. There's one more, I think.
super lemon. It has a bow in it. Run out of fruits. What do we do? Put a bow on him. have that then that is uh that is everything i am the cube I just are definitely on the longer side of things. There's no way the letters are out of order. say it down that far. the exercise. I don't 
gonna have to run through the stage again because it is quite long. I think, I think it's here. No, cheese wheel. grab onto that ledge. I thought maybe there's like an upper area. thing I can think of is maybe just out of view here somewhere. Hmm. No. as far back as I can. So either this is in a non-linear form where I'm gonna hate it. Or I missed... I don't know. Yeah, I just died time. We'll take us back to where we were. Stop it. have to repeat the stage. look.
I mean, I think I would have seen it by now. There's no way it's this hidden. Okay, so, cool, I, I can't fix this. I have no idea where I missed this. Alright, just die, finish the stage, come back. Okay, so letter collection, that's all we're after. A is down there, that would stand to reason that the C is somewhere else. Okay, don't get a checkpoint. Simple. Okay, the A is here. So the C is 
the sea has to can't it has to be somewhere where I just straight up did not find it. Okay, I mean that's I don't know if it's more annoying or less annoying, but I guess it bothers me more that I didn't find it. I believe it's not, you know, an extra hidden area up the top. Could almost perform a, ch a cheeky skip there. See that button, I can get down there later. destroy the tombstone. I mean, I doubt it would be that crazy that it would make me destroy the tombstone. got me pretty good. Oh, 
That was a little evil, I'm not gonna lie. That's the last bonus stage side.
no. Oh, that's so annoying. You fall back now, no. It guarantees a shock. Totally worth the death. Sorry, I just saw it turn the distance. I think that's where I'm going to eventually. Thinking. To think that I missed something. I could go across there, and then there's suddenly an invisible wall. Just in case I should go 
up the damn it. Up the path. Like I know I probably did a shortcut, but I'm worried I'm gonna miss the A. I don't like these slopes. They're just very temperamental. I don't know why. that the A is missing. that they're all currently 
hovering around one corner. Oh, you dick. I got one more try. Okay, we're good. <laughs> Jeez. So I mean, this is either gonna go here or I'm gonna have to go back. I'm gonna have to go back. Yeah, okay. Oh, it's Pac Mom, not Ms. Pac Man. So it's his mother. Or that's his wife, I don't know. Holy crap, dude, that was clutch. That was clutch. <laughs> there was no other way back. Gaming moment right there. to do this again. Man's Lair, all right, this is the end. Oh, 
Okay, I'm being greedy. I'll be less greedy this time. You can get him for two. I said no more greed, but let's face it. Oh, come on. What? What was the, the camera angle spun? Thanks. Double bounce. Second form. Yeah, metal. Oh, no, okay. Again, you can do the double. my safety nuts. How many forms does he have? Thanks, pal. Oh, 
this is very particular. simply doesn't let you chase it. Thank you. I was wondering when that was going to come in. Okay. No. That's the last one. One health to spare. Unless he's. Yep. Oh, yeah, four forms! And then Pac Man's dead. <laughs> Wait, I would, I would kind of devour it. Okay, he's not dead. One would think. Now who's the real criminal? <laughs> so... It's just a ghost? Sorry for kidnapping your family and stuff, lol. I mean, look. It's not the greatest game. Not, not exactly what you would say, like, blockbuster game of the year material, but it's fun enough. And I do have nostalgia for it because I played this back in the day on the PS1. But that line... <laughs> that is the, the writing on that, and stuff. Like, I, I can't come up with anything else, so I'll just add, and stuff. Excuse now, the meme on Twitch has been, happy birthday. It's been getting out of hand, of course, yeah, happy birthday. That's, uh, that's a good way to end this. The real deal. Oh, see, I like this. This is a credits 
the sequence where you can do something in it. Um, yeah, so that was Pac-Man World. Yeah. It's a fun little game. It's pretty short. It's not the most challenging thing, but I had fun with it back in the day. I think there was a sequel. Oh. Okay, well, had I known. I've already ruined it, like it's not gonna work. Okay. I think it's just gonna say thanks. Thank you. Like, maybe I can find it all still. Yeah, I mean, look. Why did this need to have a license agreement, really? I, I just, that's the thing I can't get over. It's gonna say thank you for playing, assuming I collect it. I tried to go too perfectionist on it. I wonder if it's set in stone or if it's random. If it's random, I have a chance. If it's set in stone, I I've already ruined it. <laughs> they wrote a song about Pac-Man. I'm sure it already exists. They wrote a song about Mario back in the day. Before my time, but like... Super Mario Bros. 1 had a theme written for it. Trying to go in a straight line. Yeah. I hope that doesn't count. I do like games that do that, that give you something to do during the credits. It's quite a neat little thing. Okay, well, that was Pac-Man World. I hope you enjoyed the playthrough of it. I know I did. Just nostalgia sells. The era of nostalgia. Okay, well, if you are here on YouTube, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, all that stuff. And yeah, let me know if you want to see anything in particular played. I'll consider it. Alright, I'm gonna go get some food and yeah, go about to my day. But take care. See you next time.